Okay guys, um, been in communication with a uh, a friend of mine, new friend I guess, over in Romania. Uh, his YouTube channel is uh, DX Explorer. And uh, we've been talking back and forth about a little um, 20 meter, 40 meter, uh, 80 meter Regenda receiver that he had built. And um, it's built on the schematic here, the receptor, he calls it. And uh, basically, you see, pretty, pretty nice little uh, schematic. Got to wind the coil and everything. Got a, a board layout and whatnot. And uh, basically, I'm going to try and uh, duplicate this circuit. Um, apparently the transistors that this thing uses, the uh, BF214 and EFT323, two of those, apparently they seem to be kind of uh, hard to get your hands on. Um, and uh, I'm trying to figure out if there's some way that we can put new type of uh, transistors in here to do the same job. So, uh, I'm going to try and uh, build this circuit using some modern transistors. Um, 2N3904s or 2N3906 or something like that. And we'll see what we got there in the, in the bin of transistors. And we're going to see if we can make this little radio work. Um, he's got a video uploaded about his little receiver and I got to say it's awesome. It's a very nice for sure um, so the uh, wording that's in this document um, he uh, translated it into uh, into English that he's also got um, done which is very nice of him to uh, translate this into English so basically what I'm planning on doing is building this circuit so tonight I've uh, done went ahead and done a bit of work on the layout of how I'm going to build my receiver. Um, I spent about two hours constructing this so far, and I got to say I'm quite pleased with what I come up with. Uh, the circuitry is not uh, not done yet. It's just the basic uh, guts of the radio, I suppose, the controls, antenna connector, the boards, that kind of thing. But uh, Without further ado, here is my receiver that I'm going to uh, try to build. So we've got a potentiometer here, got an on off switch here. I'm going to use this here as a uh, headphone, headphone jack. I've got a tuning capacitor right here. Um, and I've got a BNC for an antenna connector. I've got power here. Uh, I may up. I may swap out the um, this jack for the RCA. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with that yet. But um, so that's the parts I'm using. A little capacitor ahead. Uh, I might build them up with something a little bit, a little bit uh, bigger. But we'll see. Whatever I can fit there, I guess. I've got two perf boards side by side. I'm going to do this in such a way that I'm going to try and build the audio amplifier on one board and I'm going to build the receiver on the other board. That's my plan anyways. How that's going to work is anybody's guess. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So basically this is the layout of my receiver at the present time. So uh, yeah. Uh, DX Explorer. This is my attempt at, uh, at building this radio so uh, we're going to see what we can come up with um, I got the perf boards screwed right down to the to the uh, perf, perf board the wood or whatever this is press board and uh, it holds it quite firmly not going nowhere and we're just going to solder directly on top of the board so uh, yeah so uh, I hope you uh, 
hope you're going to follow along. See if we can see what I can come up with. And uh, everything, everything turns, controls work. On the switch. Antenna, power. So there you go. Headphone jack. But uh, there we go. The aluminum pieces I'm using here. That's two pieces. That's uh, two heat sinks actually out of a out of one out of a CB radio. Two of them. A TRC 465. That's the heat sink that usually be on the inside of those radios. So I got that flattened out. So I'm using those for the, to hold the uh, front panels on. And uh, this piece of aluminum is from the heat sink from an old 23 channel. Um, CB radio that held this transistor. So, here we go. Anyways, just a little, little video. Um, so another piece of aluminum there I might use for something, but we'll see. Anywho, uh, there we have it. So, over the weekend, tomorrow night, over the weekend, we're going to see if we can't recreate the receptor. That's an actual, that's a nice name, I like that. <laughs> so I'm actually call this thing the receptor. <laughs> yeah, anyways, hey folks, thanks for watching. And uh, the X Explorer. Let's see what we can. Uh, let's see what we can come up with here. All the best, guys.